Now at 11, mystery at sea. A Carnival cruise ship returns to Miami without one of its passengers. It is likely the man went overboard. CBS 4's Amber Diaz is live at Port Miami with an update on this search. Amber. Well, unfortunately, the U.S. Coast Guard has not given us an update as to whether they found that man or not. But according to the ship's captain, cameras on the ship caught the man going overboard. We've done many cruises, but this is the first time anything like this devastating like this has ever happened. Officials say this 26 year old man went overboard from the Carnival Victory cruise ship Friday morning, about 35 miles south of Isla Morada. The ship was returning to Miami from a four night cruise that stopped in Key West in Cozumel. About four o'clock this morning, we started receiving announcements in our cabins. They kept saying his name. Have you seen him? And then he said, everybody stay in your room until it's cleared. We are proceeding at full speed to the area where he was last seen. And then at that point, we realized something was something wasn't right because I mean I've cruised before and I've never been disturbed so early in the morning. Passengers aboard the almost 900 foot cruise ship took to Twitter with updates, some showing TV screens with the man's face, even a picture of the woman he was reportedly traveling with. I just feel bad for the family. Around noon, the ship made its way back to Port Miami. The U.S. Coast Guard not saying if the man was found. This was in our room when we went back to our room to get, you know, after we ate dinner. The letter signed by the ship's captain reads in part, we are continuing our search and rescue efforts for our missing guest. Once again, thank you for your patience and understanding. Please keep our guest and his family in your thoughts and prayers. The crew did a phenomenal job. They were awesome. Kept us well alerted as to what was going on and uh, made more, you know, made us more or less comfortable. It was a long day for passengers and a long day for the crew, all wondering about the man who appeared on their TV screens. Now back out here live at Port Miami, passengers who booked their flights through Carnival and missed them have been compensated. In Port Miami, Amber Diaz, CBS4 News, tonight. All right, Amber, thank you very much.